Brian Sensei here. Do you use Microsoft 365 email, but also use additional email accounts like Gmail and Yahoo Mail? Well, guess what? You can add those additional accounts to the Outlook app so that you can see your mail from all these different accounts in one place. Let's check it out. Okay, so first thing I wanna do is show you here in Outlook Web, I'm using Outlook in the browser. You'll notice here on the left that there's this icon here to add an account. It actually says add Gmail account, but it's grayed out. And when you click it, you're going to see here that you'll need to use the new Outlook for desktop for all your accounts, including Gmail and Yahoo. So you'll want to download this new version of Outlook. All right, once you have it installed, you can go ahead and search for that new Outlook app. Search Outlook and you'll see here Outlook new. Go ahead and click there to launch it. All right, and here I am in the new Outlook desktop app. We can see over here at the right that this is new Outlook, and we can actually switch this off to go back to classic Outlook, but I'm gonna stay here. Now, to add additional email accounts, I'm gonna go over here to the far left and click on the hamburger or navigation pane. Then I'm gonna come all the way down to add account. All right, and here you're going to see that you can add Microsoft 365 accounts, Gmail, Yahoo, iCloud, and more. All you have to do is enter in your email address for the account you want to add. And I'll click continue. It's going to ask me if I want to sync my Gmail account. I'll go ahead and click continue. Here I am taken to the browser where I need to select the Gmail account that I want to use and click continue and review what the app is going to be allowed to access. Then I'm going to go ahead and click allow. All right, if you get this message, it's trying to open Outlook new, go ahead and click open and success. Your emails are now synced. I'll go ahead and click done. All right, now you're gonna see here we have our inbox for my Outlook email. And if I scroll down, we're going to see the new Gmail account listed here. We'll go ahead and click here to expand this. And boom shakalaka, here's the inbox for the Gmail account. And we can toggle back and forth between these email accounts freely. To add another account, simply go back to the bottom and click on Add Account. If you decide you want to remove the additional email account that you've added, you can simply click the More menu next to the email address and go to Manage Account. Here you'll find the additional email address and you can click Manage and Remove. If you've added this account on other devices, you can select remove from all devices. In this case, I've only added it here, so I'm going to remove from this device. And I'll click OK. And there we have it. Now we just are back to my main Outlook.com email address. If you want to see more of these videos, consider subscribing to my channel and click the notification button so you can be notified every time I post new videos. If you have a specific tech tip you'd like me to create, please let me know by completing the form in the description below. And I'll see you on the next one.